The Oklahoma County District Attorney files charges against a former inmate and her accomplice. Court documents say that the two were attempting to bring fentanyl right into the jail. News 9's Angelicia Bruton shows us how they were able to catch them. Mailroom staff here at the Oklahoma County Detention Center say they were sorting through mail when they came across something suspicious. After taking a closer look, they noticed that someone might have been trying to smuggle drugs in, so they called an investigator. Last October, mailroom employees say they came across two packages addressed to Jordan Keith. Jail Trust CEO Brandy Gardner says they are presented as legal mail. We can't open mail that is marked legal mail uh, without a reason to do so. Uh, it has to be opened in the presence of the inmate. But um, in this case, we were able to identify that there was just something off with it. The post stamps from Colorado raise some red flags. Every piece of legal mail that comes in, we are notifying the attorney, um, not only the attorney of record, but also following, you know, whoever sent the mail and asking them, did you legitimately send this piece of mail to this person in our custody? The probable cause affidavit says an investigator found several pills hidden inside one of the packages. The other package had a card that appeared to be discolored. OSBI test contents for both packages and they came back positive for fentanyl and methamphetamine. It would kill dozens of people. Inside the package was also information linking investigators to the sender, Terrence Bermude. Jail phone records show Keith had been calling him from inside the jail. He's got a warrant out for his arrest. Once Bermude is in custody, he will be facing charges along with Keith. Garner says the jail is undergoing a restructuring process, which includes mail scanning to catch things like this. Inmates will receive their mail digitally. It'll allow my staff to have more time to really scrutinize the mail that is coming in, which is legal mail and packages. Angelique Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.